Hi friends, I'm Shumon and welcome to AAC Technical. Today I'm going to show you how to fix Windows fail to start and boot configuration data. Unfortunately, sometimes you are facing such a huge problem like Windows fail to start. A recent hardware or software change might be the cause. Well, don't worry about it. By following these instructions, in this video you can easily get the solution of this problem. Well, let's get started. At first, to fix the problem, you need an original Windows installation media. It can be Windows 10, Windows 8 or Windows 7 and then follow the instructions properly. Alright, insert the original Windows installation CD or DVD and just restart your computer. To restart, press and hold the Ctrl and Alt keys on the keyboard and then press the delete key and be ready to enter your PC's BIOS. Alright, then go to boot menu and select boot from inserted CD or DVD. Save configuration changes and exit. And be ready to press any key to boot from inserted CD or DVD. Then click on next. And then click on repair your computer. Alright, click on Troubleshoot option and choose Advanced option. Next click on Command Prompt. Now you have to rebuild the VCD, I mean boot configuration data. Just follow the instruction exactly. Just type the command bootrec space forward slash fix tmbr then press enter. Next type the command bootrec space forward slash fix boot then press enter. Next type the command bootrec space forward slash scanos then press enter. Alright, now we can see total identified Windows installation to NOS. We can see it because my PC has dual boots. Don't worry, you will not see it. Well, next type the command bootrec space forward slash rebuild VCD, then hit enter. Alright, next type the command Y for yes. I am going to type A for all because my PC has dual boots and I want to keep both OS in my PC. Yeah, done. And type the final command exit then hit enter. And just turn off your PC. Just patient for a while and then turn the PC back on. Alright, now as you can see the computer's boot is fixed from Windows bootloader. 
Now let's check both OS working properly or not. Yeah, as you can see Windows 10 and Windows 7 both OS working properly. We hope you will like. Of course, let us know your opinion. If you have any questions, then please let us know. Please like, comment and share. We need your support. And guys, please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.